tell me your name? Uh, my name is Jelani Gibson. And where do, you, where do you come from? Um, I'm from Pontiac. Okay. And what grade are you? Tenth, ma'am. And why did you come out to New York? I came out to New York because I heard my grandmother was going at first, and I wanted to go because I am always hearing about how banks are getting bailed out, how companies are getting these tax cuts, and how resources are being robbed from other countries and whatnot, but I don't ever hear about people protesting about it and a large group. And when I heard about it, I'm like, oh, wow, Grandma's going, so maybe I can just ask her to take me with her, and she did. My grades are up in school because I have a 4.0, so I was like, okay, yeah, you can go. I realized that once the previous generation is gone, my generation will be left with a mess, and it's like, do I really like what I'm being left with here? The first night I stayed in this park, the second night I stayed in a hostel, and now we're staying back here again. It's a very interesting experience because I've never slept outside like that before, um, but I was still warm because they have comfort here, so more often than not, people's comforts and needs can be addressed. Yes, ma'am. I think I have. I mean, some do seem homeless to me and some don't. But it's hard to make that distinction because there's so many creative types here. There's so many different appearances. So it's like, they just kind of chose that one. I mean, it's kind of odd when I think about it, but it's like, eh, the guy with the green hair also there looks kind of odd also, Jelani. Um, would you say like, people are taking care of each other here? What's the best? the compassion here. Everybody's always helping one another, everyone. And even if you're not assigned to a help center of sorts here, you're still helping out people. And people are just really like, hey, you need something, man? Or, um, hey, I'm here for you. And people are like that to everyone. Can you give us an example of that? Um, I, me and my grandmother were setting up our sleeping area. And this man was coming around like, hey, you need some tarp? Or you need... Uh, blankets or something, there's comfort right over there. I can go get you something. And there was more than just him walking around. I noticed that there are other people doing it. And even when there weren't people walking around, there are other people still helping out other people's their sleeping area. And that's really nice in my opinion.